Motion graphics comprising animated graphic design are powerful tools for visual storytelling to make complex things simple and interesting to us. This makes your videos pop on a YouTube, TikTok, and Instagram. You can get more views and earn money. I will show you three easy motion graphics technique, please watch until the end. I will use CapCut and Canva to make this awesome graphic animation. Let's start. Graphic. Animation. 1. You need a black grid background, I will use Canva. Create a design and click on YouTube thumbnail. Go to Elements. In the search bar write down grid background. Change the background color black. Download the background. Make graphic element now. Change the background color green. Go to Element. In the search bar write airplane. Bring the airplane in green background. Click on share and download as a JPG file format. Repeat the same steps to create globe with green background. Open CapCut and bring the black grid background into timeline. First need to bring the airplane click on the blue plus circular icon. Move this airplane clip up. And then go to remove background chroma key color picker. Increase intensity 44. Add this globe background into timeline. And then move it up. And then go to remove background chroma key color picker. Increase intensity 32. Select the airplane clip. Drag all the way left. Decrease scale 61%. Drag the plane parallel to the globe. Rotate the plane. Select the globe clip. Go to animation, choose combo. And add this animation here. And make the duration. Like 1.5 second. Move the playhead 1.5 second location. Move the plane layer up to globe layer and the plane will be appear after 1.5 second later. Add first keyframe for airplane go to basic. Add first keyframe for scale and position. Then move the playhead 10 frame forwards and drag plane right. Position keyframe will automatically add here. Make the plane layer 2 so plane can show top of the globe layer. Move the playhead 30 frames forward and drag the plane right. Keyframe will be added here automatically. Make the animation smooth for the airplane. Click on the select the video show keyframe animation. And choose X. Select the point and click on auto curve. So right now you will see the smooth animation. Or go to audio. Add sound effect. Export. Final outcome. Graphic animation 2. Make the triangle element first by using Canva repeat the process shown on graphic animation 1. Bring the black background. Make the opacity. 60% and bring this triangle. Go to Remote Background Chroma Key Color Picker. Make the Intensity 30 and Shadow 17. Go to Mask Choose Horizontal and make it Reverse. Drag the white line all the way down. Make sure X is 0. Add first position keyframe here. Move the playhead 30 frame forward. Drag this white line all the way up. Position keyframe will automatically add it here. Go to text. Bring the text where second keyframe place on the triangle. Make the text hyphen hyphen to make a straight line. 
and scroll down and make the character minus 4. And increase the font size. And move it in up and right click make it compound clip. Go to video. And rotate the line on the left hand side. Minus. 8 degree. Click on text and add default text. Add dot. Increase the scale. Drag the up to the bar. Select this line. Go to video mask horizontal. And click on reverse. Rotate this line all the way up minus 84 degree and drag this line all the way left. Add first position keyframe here. Move the playhead forward. Drag this white line middle. Position keyframe will add it here. Move the playhead at the end of the clip and drag the white line all the way right. Keyframe added here automatically. Select the ball layer move the ball little bit left side. Add first opacity and position keyframe here. Make the opacity 0. Ball disappear. Move the playhead 10 frame forward. Drag the ball to place it on the line. Make the opacity 100%. Move the playhead all the way end of this line. Drag the ball all the way left. Select the clip and right click and make it compound clip. Go to effects and add glow effects into ball clip. Adjust the effects. Add some glow also in the triangle. Adjust the keyframe animation for smooth appearance of the element. Final outcome. Graphic. Animation. 3. Make graphic elements first bouncing ball. Make the background green and add bouncing ball. Bring the grid black background. Go to blend. And make the opacity. The 50%. Then go to text. Default text. Write hyphen couple of times then scroll down. Character minus 4. Scroll down give the stroke. Choose the color. Red. Reduce the thickness of stroke. Scroll up and change the inside color white to black. So you see your bar is ready right now. I will make it white color. Change the color and even increase it like this. Select Ctrl C to copy and Ctrl V to paste. Go to basic. Select the second clip make this color white. And scroll down. Uncheck stroke. Select the first line. For first line by right click make compound clip and do the same for second line. For the second clip go to video mask. Choose the horizontal. Rotate this white line minus 90 degree. Drag this white line all the way left. Add first keyframe here. Move the playhead 30 frame forward.
drag this white line all the way right. Position keyframe added here and add rotation keyframe. Then bring the bouncing ball and move it up. Select and go to Remote Background Chroma Key. Color Picker. Increase Intensity. Crop the bottom part. Drag the ball on left side. Go to Video. Add first position and opacity keyframe. Move the playhead 5 frame forward. Drag the ball top of the slide bar. Position keyframe automatically added. Give opacity keyframe here. Go backward. Make the opacity zero. So first the ball disappear and appear at the starting of the slide bar. Move the playhead 30 frame forward. Drag the ball all the way right. Position keyframe out of here and add the opacity. So you can see how it goes away. Move the playhead 2 frame forward. Add position and opacity keyframe here. Opacity 0. Go to sticker. Click on this sticker and add exactly last keyframe of bouncing ball. Increase the scale. Drag the ball up to the sliding bar. Go to animation. And give the an animation. Bouncing and make the duration 1.1 second. Export it. Final outcome. Thanks for watching.